So, ladies and gentlemen, we are very happy to welcome you in the caring suite in the Majestic, in the framework of a Women in Motion program. One out of three women around the globe is beaten, coerced into sex or otherwise abused in her lifetime. This explains why the Caring Group decided in 2009 to create a foundation to address those issues. It happened uh, six weeks before my competition by an Israeli travel agent in Milan who fooled me. He took me uh, to a secluded road, raped me, strangled me, uh, and almost uh, took my life. I decided 10 years ago to do this film with my friend Moti Raif. Something that's first going to help me can help so many women around the world. It's something not very easy to talk about, but I'm in a mission. I've also been raped. At 18, I mean, so many of us are. It's no coincidence we're sitting here on a panel of four women, and at least two have been raped. So, of course, I wanted from the very outset to make a documentary that would engender a campaign. I wanted India to inspire other nations to go out onto the streets for civil society to express its commitment to change when it comes to violation of human rights, which is what we're talking about here. We had our official premiere at um, AFI Docs in uh, Washington, D.C., and so we've shown in, in Mumbai and many different international uh, film festivals. We've curated over 600 testimonials on our website of rape stories by men and women, and we have over a million uh, visitors to our website. The biggest problem in women's movement has been that we have not worked enough with men. We don't see enough men who have joined the campaign. So I hope your films can also be shown to men and work with men can increase. We know very well how men look, how men live, and women most of the time are objects in, in that look. My first desire uh, at the bottom of Mustang was to say what it is to be a girl and a woman in Turkey. But each time I came, come back to Turkey, I had the impression of being corseted and so I felt it very strongly.